Hey guys, it's Thomas, and I'm, today I'm going to be showing you Patreon Antivirus's new features and uh, the exclusive Patreon Antivirus Lite. So let's just start with the original version here. Alright, so the first new feature I added is uh, Clean. So yeah, as you guys can read here, removes all potential determined threats of the scan items. Uh, that's very helpful if you just want to you want to be a basic user, you just want to scan and clean. Um, I'll run a uh, full scan right now, and I'll be back in a second. Uh, also, I added these new features down here. You see, like uh, the scrolling little um, progress bar as it's preparing to perform the folder scan. And afterwards, it turns to a real progress bar. Uh, the text under the status text, it is now actually centered. Um, so you're not going to have to worry about multiple operating system compatibility because everything looks the exact same way on all operating systems. That's very, uh, very nice to know. Alright, so guys, I'm going to pause the video really quick, and I'll be back once the full scan is completed. Alright guys, we're back. The scan is completed. As you guys can see, total of 124 items are scanned. Um, so now let me talk about some extra features. Alright, so as you guys can see right here, uh, I added highlighting over, uh, like, tooltips uh, over the items. We'll show you the entire file location. And that's nice if you actually want to find the file location without having to go to information. <clears throat> in information, what's really great is uh, you can now resize the information uh, dialog to whatever you want. So it gives you a lot more viewing room if you need it to uh, look at more information about the infections and whatnot. Um, what's nice also is it has a little icon up there, just uh, generally better. Alright, so I'm going to close out of this and let's move on to the uh, light version. And uh, let me just show you guys comparison here. The light version is only uh, 336 kilobytes, while the uh, the full version is 2,048 kilobytes. So there's a really big difference between the two. Uh, this is very very portable, um, although it does look a bit a bit less uh, advanced, although it has all the same features that you expect. So let's go ahead and uh, let me show you. How it reacts is very, very quick. There's no animations, nothing really fancy about this. Just wanted to show you guys that first. Alright, so let's go back to the main version. Alright, another cool new feature is drag and drop. You can drag any file, including uh, link files and pictures and all that, and you can automatically scan it. Patreon will handle everything uh, for you. So let's take the light version and drag it in there and see the result. There's a result, you can view information about it. See so a variant of Java says J shrink. All good. Um, there that is. Um, you can also take shortcuts like Google Chrome, um, and it'll resolve the actual file location here. Oops, I always do this. Uh, as you guys can see, the actual point, pointing location is uh, for the shortcuts target. As you guys can see here, the uh, this target link instead of the actual shortcut. Same thing works with Eclipse. Skype, Battlefield 3, and also you can drag multiple files in at a time. Um, you can also do this with regular EXEs like Minecraft, uh, and you can do it with entire folders. I'll do something a little smaller, um, bit minor folder. There you go. <laughs> it failed to scan one of these files. Oh, it's a shortcut that points to nothing. That's why. Um, but yeah, that's about uh, the features that I want to show you guys. There's also remove, you can delete some files uh, on Um uh, There's also clean, which lets you clean uh, all the files that are red. There are no red, obviously, you can't clean them out. But it's nice if you have like hundreds and hundreds of files and you don't want to look through all of them and not manually remove. You just go actions, clean, then it's done. Alright, so that's about it, guys. That's uh, all I want to show you. Also, uh, you guys missed this before it, when you uh, bring them down. Application gets minimized as system tray. Oops, that's a lot of fake ones that uh, Windows has problems with restoring. Then you can just click here and uh, the window will appear once more. Then minimize it again and bring it back up. That's nice. It's all good. Um, I'll see you guys later. Uh, description has all the download links for the regular and light version. Thank you guys, subscribe, do whatever, see ya.